Ayo, hey what's going on everybody? Welcome back to another video on my channel. As always, thank you guys very much for clicking on this video. And today for you guys, I have quite the interesting game for you guys today. It is called... The Children of Clay. The Children of Clay is a short stop motion archaeology horror game where you have to study an ancient artifact and discover its dark secret. I have no idea what this game is about to show us right now, but it looks interesting. I'm looking at the screenshots right now. I don't know. I don't know what's in store for us, but look at this. We have like this totem we got to check out. We got to discover its dark secrets. Name, artifacts number 297. Site, Curtain Burial Mound, 7B, Ural Mountains. Material, clay, age, unknown. Function, unknown. Holy shite. All right, here we are, you guys. So, we're on our desk. We just got back from the archaeology site, and now we got to discover this thing. No controls. Wasn't really a menu or search for. Huh? Okay, I don't know what to type in right there. Okay, what do we got here? Okay, let's see. What are we looking at here? Ancient artifact. Looks to be some sort of totem symbol we have some characteristics here we got what looks to be two eyes a nose a mouth and then we have some strange uh lines right here so i don't know what these could possibly mean search for i don't know how this works okay gotta check out the other sides they seem to be some sort of runes, but I don't recognize the type. Maybe I can find something in my books. What kind of symbols we got here? We got like an A, a backward C, an M, kind of. Yeah, this is what we're seeing. Right there. I can move the compass. Okay. Perhaps these mean... Perhaps this is a code or something, I don't know exactly. Let's go ahead and rotate our piece here. Take a closer look at the back. I don't know what this uh, distinction is right here on the back. We got this uh, darker colored blemish right here. Don't know what that could mean. Okay, so our, our point of interest right now is these right here. Now, I don't know how to type these in. Am I supposed to like be like A, C, M... What is that? Like a plus sign? It won't even let me put in a plus sign. Perhaps if I... A compass is detecting a magnetic field, so it likely contains iron. I see that. So this little trunk right here could be iron. How about that? Can we type in iron? Oh, here we go. The earliest known ironwork is dated from 3500 BC and made from meteoric iron. There are two main types of ironwork, wrought iron or cold iron and cast iron. Or no, wrought iron is cold iron and cast iron. Cold iron has a long and varied tradition in the mythology and folklore of the world. Interesting, okay. So we've got that written down in our notes now. Is there any other orientation that the compass will detect. This feature resembles a human face. Yes, it does. The face. The face. Anything else? Oh, the runes. Can we type in runes? Oh my god. I can translate the runes with this chart. Good idea. Okay, so what do we got here? Wait. The old Hungarian script or Hungarian runes is an alphabetic writing system for the writing the Hungarian used for writing the Hungarian language. After the establishment of the Christian Hungarian kingdom, the old writing system was partly forced out of use during the rule of King Stefan and the Latin alphabet was adopted. However, among some professions, examples shepherds who used a rovas stick to officially track the number of animals, the script has remained in use. Old Hungarian letters were usually written from right to left. Okay, okay, okay. So, 
with all that being said, what are we translating here? We got G N G N U. What? Wait. Okay. G. Wait, what the fuck? Okay, wait. What's the A with the fucking little thing in it? That looks like a G. G? What's the backward C? O? Why would I have why was I saying U? G G O U? G O U I G O U I R U G O U G O U I R U G O U I R U I cannot find anything relevant. Okay, so you're fucking dumbass motherfucking telling me that I have to fucking write it down because I'm stupid. That's awesome. Where do I even want to write it down at? Alright guys, I've been having a hard time trying to remember this shit, so I just gotta like, write it down. Gooder? G-O-U-D-R? What the fuck? I don't... This hasn't translated anything. What do you mean? I've already looked at this. It doesn't really translate to any word. What, is it supposed to be an L, for fuck's sake? What? Is it a G-N or an L-N? I can see. I don't fucking get it. G-O... We have two Cs. We have, like, this one is more complete than this one. So that would be O. G-O. We have an M that's can. I'm supposed to search something, but I don't know what it is. Your your Duke? I think maybe I'm doing this wrong. I could possibly be doing this wrong. It's it's your it's I I've got your your Duke. <laughs> I don't know. Okay, guys, I did not look up a tutorial or anything like that. Wow, it's the next page. You're done. Why? How, are you serious? That's not. I don't even know how to explain it. That's not the first word that comes to mind. I'm never gonna try to put that word together ever. An old Hungarian. Guys, I've been at this forever. Like, I cannot find fucking anything to get that whatever... God. There's a shape-shifting demonic creature from Hungarian mythology and early Hungarian paganism who controls the dark and evil forces of the world. After Christianization, it was identified with the devil. One surviving folktale about Yerdung involves one of the spawns of Yer... Is it Yerdung? Erdung? I mean, what a fitting name for a demon, am I right? Arriving to Earth and the shaman of the village consulting the spirits to learn how to trap the creature. Oh no, he's crying. Interesting, some sort of dark liquid is flowing out of the holes. True, that is very true. Now, I don't know what I would possibly be... Ch Looks like the dark liquid loosened the metal object. It's a nail. Oh god. Oh god. <laughs> What's happening to me? Whoa. Holy shite. Exempt from the newspaper article titled The Children of Clay, just a few months after the disappearance of the esteemed archaeologist and the incident involving a broken artifact, the team working on the remote site in the Urals has made an astonishing discovery. A previously unknown underground chamber containing a dozen similar small clay figures has been discovered. They are already in contact with several universities across the globe to further study them. Oh my god, yeah, man. Fuck. God. That was the Children of Clay? Are you kidding me? I'm not saying it was a bad game, but I took like 30 minutes just trying to figure out what the next thing to type in was. I just wanted to get a video out there because I know that I'm kind of slacking on consistency. Um, I was I was never going to be able to spell your dung out of this. <laughs> Sorry. But... Um, interesting game nonetheless. Um, like if you liked it, subscribe if you subscribed it, and um, thank you for watching if you thanks for watching it. And as always, link is in the description of this game, and I'll see you in the next one. Take care and peace out. Where's the? F Take care and peace out.